Hi dear viewers, uh, our today topic of discussion is equilibrium constant expression in terms of partial pressure. As we know that when all the reactants and products are in gaseous phase, we can express the equilibrium constant expression in terms of partial pressure. Uh, the, this is a general reversible equation in which all the reactants and products are in gaseous phase. So, we can express uh, the equilibrium constant in terms of partial pressure as we know that the partial pressure of any gas uh, is uh, dependent upon the molar concentration of that gas according to ideal gas equation. As we know that in the ideal gas equation is PV equals to NRT. We can rearrange this equation by shifting V uh, on the other side of the equation that is P equals to N over V times RT. Uh, this quantity N over V, what is this? This is the number of moles of gas per unit volume and is simply the molar concentration. So we can write uh, this equation as P, P equals to molar concentration molar concentration times RT. So from this equation we can we see that the partial pressure this is the partial pressure the partial pressure of any gas in the equilibrium mixture is directly proportional to the molar concentration of any substance. So from this equation we can relate that the partial pressure of any gas in the equilibrium mixture is directly proportional to its molar concentration at a given temperature. Therefore we can write the equilibrium constant expression in terms of partial pressure in instead of molar concentration. For general reversible equations say, say we have L moles of L reacts with m moles of m it gives y moles of y and z moles of z as this is a gaseous phase reversible general equation we can write the equilibrium constant expression for this so we have, uh, we can write Kp for this, where the subscript in P did, uh, signifies the partial pressure and where K is the equilibrium constant. So we can write it as, that is partial pressure of Y uh, raised to power Y into partial pressure of z raised to power z divided by partial pressure of l raised to power l into partial pressure of m raised to power small m here in this expression, we can we relate our products and reactants in terms of partial pressure. Where small p, py is the partial pressure of uh, y product, where pz is the partial pressure of z product, where pn is the partial pressure of l, and where pm is the partial pressure of m. And all the moles can be written in in the form of superscripts as we did earlier in terms of equilibrium constant. So this is the equilibrium constant expression when all the reactants and products are in gaseous phase. So we can derive this equilibrium constant expression when all the reactants and products are in gaseous phase. Consider an example in which we have in which we have uh, one mole of nitrogen reacts with three moles of hydrogen 
it gives two moles of ammonia for that reversible chemical uh, gaseous phase reaction we can write the kp value uh, the kp expression for it as kp for this reaction can be written as partial pressure of ammonia raised to power 2 divided by partial pressure of nitrogen into partial pressure of hydrogen raised to power 3. This is the Kp expression for this uh, uh, reversible uh, chemical equation. So we can write the Kp expression for any gaseous phase reaction in terms of partial pressures. Consider one more example in which we have in which we have hydrogen reacts with iodine to form hydrogen iodide. This is our second example in which we have hydrogen reacts with this is a gaseous phase reaction reacts with iodine to form two moles of hydrogen iodide so we can write again the kp expression for this reversible uh, chemical reaction that is partial pressure of hydrogen iodide raised to power 2 divided by partial pressure of hydrogen into partial pressure of iodine. So these are the two examples where partial pressure can be expressed in atmospheres. So this is our, this is our today's topic. If uh, you like this topic, if you understand this topic, uh, then please subscribe my channel, like my video and uh, share this video to your fellow friends. Okay guys, see you in next video. Allah Hafiz.